For more update, please subscribe United News 24 YouTube channel and press the bell button. Last season on 1000 Love Sisters, viewers watched Amy Slayton separate and divorce her husband, Michael. But how much was Amanda Halterman involved? That's the question many fans are asking on Reddit as the new season continues. Listen on to get the scoop and see what others have to say about the situation. No one wants to see Amy Slayton in pain. However, fans wish she would make better decisions when it comes to her romantic life. Although her marriage to Michael Halterman was incredibly toxic, fans aren't sure that she's any better off on her own. It's gonna be an unpopular opinion, I'm sure, but I personally don't think they would have even divorced had it not been for her family's influence, and possibly Michael's. One 1000 Old Sisters fan wrote on Reddit, Amy was an overwhelmed mom and she basically went scorched earth, she is in a much worse spot now than she ever was with Michael. The OP went on to point out Amy's current legal issues stemming from the infamous zoo trip. On top of that, her boyfriend was arrested with her at the zoo. In a nutshell, her sons were possibly in danger in his presence. Other 1000 Old Sisters fans agreed with the OP. Most expressed that they didn't like Michael Halterman or how he treated Amy. But on the other hand, Amy seems to be emotionally distraught since ending their marriage. But surprisingly enough, many believed that Amanda Halterman really fueled Amy's divorce. Amanda used to be married to Michael's brother, Jason. They went through a nasty divorce of their own. Plenty of viewers think Amanda influenced her sister's decision to cut ties with the Haltermans too. What do you think ultimately fueled Amy Slayton's divorce from Michael Halterman? Share your own thoughts and ideas in the comments. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our United News 24 YouTube channel for more update news.